Am I the arsehole? For skinny dipping in my sister's backyard with her permission? My sister owns a house in the suburbs with a pool. I visit and stay over often. Last night around 11 p.m., we both decided to go skinny dipping in her pool, at my suggestion. The backyard has a high fence that should obscure us, or so we thought. This morning, my sister's neighbor from across the street who lives in a two-story house came over and started telling my sister that her 11F and 9M kids saw us skinny dipping because their rooms are on the second floor which apparently overlooks my sister's backyard. She even claimed her kids are now traumatized and said she'll call the police if we ever skinny dip again. We obviously didn't mean for her kids to see us and we just wanted to have some stupid fun on my sister's private property. So am I the asshole? Not the asshole. I really highly doubt it was kids that saw. Embetting hubs saw. Not the asshole. 1. Why were kids that young not in bed? 2. What kind of backwards education are they getting if they are traumatized by two naked women swimming? 3. Her property had a high enough fence for passer beast to see nothing. 4. The police will laugh their butts off, let her call them. Not the asshole. A reasonable bedtime 11 p.m. and curtains would have solved that problem. Also, if her kids don't even know what human bodies look like yet, impending puberty is likely to be a rough stretch for that 11F in particular. Her kids aren't traumatized Lamau and she won't call the police. Skinny dip all you want. Accuse them of peeping if you like. Tell her to put better curtains on the kids' rooms. Trying to wrap my head around how an across-the-street neighbor can see into a backyard pool, even if two-story house. Not the asshole. If she complains again, tell her to take away her husband's binoculars I guarantee you that's who saw, or she saw Yarl while spying and doesn't want her husband to see. I'm not sure why a naked form would traumatize children, thoughtful face. Have a six-foot fence around the backyard and always nude. Day or night. Have one neighbor who can see from his back deck but is rarely out medical issue. Not looking forward to the day he moves and the house sells. Check your state laws about reasonable expectations of privacy. Read an article written by a real estate agent years ago that a neighbor's nudity was in the top 10 reasons why people move. Cited a Supreme Court decision where you basically had three options 1 enjoyed the view, 2 plant trees 3 move. The page is long gone but is why I quit worrying about being bare in our backyard. Not the asshole. Kids should be asleep by 11. And it's pitch black out. How much can they sister has big backyard lights on? Not the asshole but you need to. 1. Legally, cover your butts find out what the local laws have to say about situations like this can you be charged with indecent exposure child endangerment? Or do you live in a live and let live area and they can be charged under peeping tom laws? 2x2 two two flesh colored bathing suits that perfectly match your skin tone and go swimming a lot. Not the asshole. Kids didn't see you, husband was watching you and she caught him. Now she's mad at him for ogling you and mad at you for being oglable. I don't think you're the asshole. I guess the better question is why the hell you skinny dipping with your sister? Smiley face. Not the asshole but FYI. In some places it can be indecent exposure if you can be seen naked. Irrelevant if you're in your own home or on your own property. If you can be seen by anybody that doesn't want to see it, you can be charged with indecent exposure. In this instance it's entirely possible that you could be found guilty of indecent exposure to a minor and made to sign the sex offenders register. If I were you, my worry wouldn't be if you're morally right or wrong, but legally. I would assume the threat of police action is real and check local laws before swimming naked again. Info are you and your sister secretly hairy purple aliens covered in green warts with three feet porcupine like spikes that glint in the moonlight? Were your after dinner drinks still screaming as their blood dropped from your razor like fang? If no, not the asshole. Not the asshole absolutely. You could have been more observant about the apartment overlooking the pool, but if someone else's kids can see into 